Pop streams. Pop streams for your face. So yeah, guys, hot streams. Oh my gosh, hot streams all up in your business. So this week I've got a really obscure one. Uh, do you like Archer? Do you like Bob's Burgers? Do you like the convenience store guy and family guy? Well, that tells me you may be a fan of John Benjamin, H. John Benjamin. He's only got one voice, but man, is it a good one. Uh, he got his start in a show called Home Movies with uh, no, sorry, before that, he was in Dr. Katz as the younger, as the son, and then he was in home movies as Coach McGurk, and since then he's just been in a ton of stuff. Right now, you can find him in Bob's Burgers and Archer. He's just great. But in between those, he did a little show called Lucy, Daughter of the Devil, where he played uh, not just one of the priests but also Satan himself. My God, was it funny. It only survived like six episodes and they're really hard to find, but let's... Uh... Previously on Lucy, the daughter of the devil. We have found it. This is the prophecy. When we translate this text, we will know the identity of the Antichrist. It says that a woman will agree to bear the child of Satan in exchange for a Datsun 280ZX. Hooves, hooves, sorry, hooves. Sorry, sorry. I know you're not, it's not purpose, I know, but, I know, noted, uh, noted. And it's, if it's not the hooves, it's the horns. <sighs> what, do you want to stop? Or no, no, I... no, let's keep going, keep going. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Just... Well, now I don't. What do I need to? No, I'll no. Oh, I. Let me just get some water. I'm glad you're here. I'll be right back. The child will be watched over by her unholy father. Look at the rack on Lucy. <laughs> ah, my face! I didn't know he could bring dogs to school. When she turns 21, her father will call upon her to fulfill her evil destiny. Look, I paid for your stupid art school, didn't I? And I got you a dog. A hypoallergenic dog, mind you, because you're allergic. Excuse me, did you just say stupid art school? Dad? No. Yes, you did. Art is not stupid, Lucy. I gotta go. So yeah, that's some... That's some quality business right there. Uh, I tell you, man, if you love, you know, this was, uh, this show's about probably eight years old now. It's pretty hard to find. You're going to have to dig deep on torrents and other such sites. Um, there are only clips of it on YouTube and there are whole episodes you can buy for like a dollar 99 each, but be careful because there are also spoofed episodes where it's just like, 30 minutes of someone looping a clip they have no rights to. You gotta be careful is what I'm saying. You've gotta be a savvy consumer of hot streams all up in yo face. It's it's really funny, it's wonderful, and just for fun, I think I'm gonna, you know what? Uh, what are we at? Less than four minutes, I'm gonna run one more clip. This is your captain speaking. Just want to let you know that as soon as we get beverages served, we're going to begin our movie for this flight, which is Legally Blonde 2. You can uh, find the audio on channel 11, and if you get a chance, also uh, take a look out your window, because pretty soon I'm going to point this plane straight down and drive us as deep into the ocean as I can. Your mother sucks <laughs> in hell. Pray to Satan. Yeah, I mean, What's not to like? Uh, the second coming of Christ is uh, foretold, and Jesus does come back, but he goes by the name DJ Jesus. He's, uh, he's an escape artist and a DJ. Uh, so when he does you know, karaoke night, he actually does escape be okay, and it's very funny. Uh, there are a lot of C-list celebrity names in it. And these people weren't famous when they made it, but they are now. They've made it to C-list. It's just a damn funny show. And again, 
only six episodes, easy to binge through the whole damn thing in an evening. That's a hot stream, and it's in your face. <laughs>